Hello friends, welcome to Prana Files and episode part number four of Demonologist. We are still grinding for money, the XP. It's not that easy. <laughs> And we still only have the abandoned house because we need level 3 to get to a new location. And we are playing on easy because we can't play on medium before we are at level 4. Which is good because we don't have don't have any crucifixes. So let's hunt some ghosts, some spirits. Last episode was creepy as f. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. But I guess all the episodes are creepy as f. Let's take our standard first equipment inside. This one to detect where the ghost is. In the first place, where we need to be concentrating our hunt. Here we are, back again. See if we can find this bastard. And it doesn't even need to be in a room. This door is already open. Isn't it usually closed when we get in? I'm not sure, actually. And this door as well is usually closed. Like I always do, go into the library first. I don't know why. Okay. Nothing going on in here, I believe. Let's check the bedroom. Wow, Jesus! Holy mother of... Box. Oh, I came with the goosebumps. Usually it don't happen that fast. But that doesn't mean the ghost is haunting in here. That's just one of the jump scares. Jeez, that scared me. <laughs> Come on. And again, like always, I forgot to check our secondary objectives. But usually it is to find some salt bags so let's be on the lookout for that I have never seen any of those salt bags or never noticed any one of them okay, I think this room is clear as well the workshop but is there any salt bags I don't know if we are supposed to look at salt bags this time but I note that we have to find five fingers for the, uh, for the ritual downstairs in the basement to exorcism the ghost, if that's the right word. <laughs> I'm not sure it is. But that gives hell of a lot of points if we do that for XP and money. Oh, Jesus. This game is gonna be the death of me. <laughs> and my neighbors must hate me. <laughs> Just screaming very loudly every time I play this game. There's no ghost. Are we gonna suck again this time? God damn it. Let's check the basement. I think that's the last place we haven't checked yet. And the door was open down here, so. I don't know if it normally is. Aha. Looks like we have activity down here. 
So we have to find. Oh. We have put the fingers in here that we eventually, hopefully, find. Oh, we have cold breath. That is definitely an evidence. Freezing temperatures. I guess the ghost is in here. It is. Okay, let's leave this here. And the easel as well. And get some more equipment. Let's get a hail out of here. Basements are just naturally creepy AF. <laughs> I hate basements. So the ghost or the spirit was blowing in my ear. You know what that means. <laughs> or at least it was blowing at something. <laughs> Sounded like it was in, in my ear. Now, let's get the spirit box. Hopefully the ghost wants to speak to us. Let's bring the ESG. Let's see if it's a talkative ghost. I don't know why I say ghost every time. It's a spirit, yeah? Is that the same? Is it though? Is a demon a ghost? I would define it as, as a spirit, right? So this is the first time we had a spirit down in the basement. What is your name? Are you here? What is your name? Am I alone? Are you a demon? I heard some knocking. Are you a poltergeist? Let's put down the... ESG. What is your name? Who are you? Are you here? Where are you? Okay. The EMF meter is not going off anymore. We are not getting anything on the spirit box. Let's turn on some lights, yeah? To Are there even any lights down here? Because that should help with our uh, sanity, not draining as fast. Someone was blowing again. It's blowing in the wind. I'm going the wrong way. Is there a way out? We really need some crucifixes. You know? <laughs> but if we are getting haunted, we need to get out of the building as soon as possible. Because it can haunt us right again after it eats our uh, crucifix. Okay, let's take the plasma thingy, and the UV light. That's all the equipment that we have. <clears throat> it's really a grind, you know, in the beginning to get some money in the bank. Let's get down, back down to the basement. See if we can find any ectoplasma stains. Anywhere. Oh, we have ectoplasma stain. There we go. Awesome. See if we can...
find any fingerprints. So it keeps opening and closing this door. So there should be a fingerprint on here. So I guess that is not gonna be a thing. Oh. Are you here? Am I alone? Are you a spirit? <sighs> oh, it's blowing again. Hello. <sighs> Let's bring this stuff in here. Are you here? Are you friendly? Okay, there's no answer. Okay. It's mostly here that we have... Oh, hello? Are we being haunted? I think this means we are haunted, right? God damn it! This game is hard! God damn it! What kind of spirit was that? I ride you. Come on! Let's do it again. We did so good in the the one episode where we got all this money and stuff. Not going so good anymore. I have a hard time getting the evidence. I maybe should have put all that stuff in in the basement and not in that room with the chair. Maybe. But that's where we got most of the EMF detection. You know? Let's do it again. This is a grind here in the beginning. Let's turn on the lights. Around these places, so. Look, now the door is closed. So it's not always open in the beginning. But all these lights will help us with our sanity. Oh, let's check the library. Mm -hmm. Don't think there's anything going on in here. Don't come jumping at me. Don't laugh at me. Let's get a hell out of here. Damn. Check in here. The workshop. No. No EMF detection. <laughs> that gets me every time. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, now I... Okay, this door is open. I think it might be randomly generated. If the doors are open or not. Ouija board, but what do we do? What do we do with the Ouija board? I don't know. I have no clue. Are you in the basement again? If you have any good tips, leave leave them in the comments. 
you know what I can do better in this game. Because I feel like I suck. <laughs> but we are learning, you know, every time. We're getting no EMF detection anywhere. We have been in every room now. And let's be on the lookout for fingers and salt bags. Sometimes we have to do a ritual uh, at a pentagram, but this isn't a pentagram. So where is the pentagram? If you know, also tell me in the comments. Where is this thing? Hello? It's not very active right now. Hmm. Okay, let's go to all the rooms again that we already been in. Do you want to play with me? Let's play. I'm ready. I see no salt bags anywhere or fingers. But I don't understand we have why we are not getting EMF detection somewhere. All of the ghosts react to the EMF. Magna. Where the F are you, man? There's no activity anywhere at all. Any salt bags here? No? Hmm. I think also there was some spirits that are more uh, more active at certain times of day this is the time right now in my country where the f are you so i guess maybe this is that spirit i don't remember which one it was was it an onryo no what else have we had Right, you? No? Sayure? No. Yokai? Yeah. Strength will be very active between 6 to 8. So, it could be this one, you know? Since it's not very active now. nothing going on here so maybe we have to go go back home and come again and hopefully we get another spirit because we are getting no detection at all Maybe that's a good time to do the secondary objectives. So let's go out to the tent and see what our secondary objectives are. I think that's, that'd be a good idea. Right? Come 
Come on now, run! Please. So we have to take a solid photo. Can't do that. We don't have a camera. And correct the crucifixes. And read the last note. But what the F do we do with that Ouija port? I have no clue. But to exercise the ghost, we have to find five missing fingers and place them in the ritual area in the basement. Let's find some cruise fixes that we can correct. And a lost note somewhere. Let's get back in. Because we have a wall where there are many crucifixes on. But they are always turning the right the right way. So let's see if we can find other crucifixes around. And be on the lookout for those fingers. I never found a finger. <laughs> Not alone five. Don't know where to look for them either. But let's be on the lookout for crucifixes turning the wrong way. And fingers, of course. Because we can exercise the ghost without have, knowing what kind of ghost it is. And of course we will just run around with the EMF meter so maybe at some point we will detect it. But the only cruise fixes I really seen are these in here. But they're all in the correct position every time. See any fingers? I don't. Okay, are, is there a setting maybe to see them better or something? No? Not at all. Nope. But I guess they'll be lying on the floor, maybe. Where the F are these crucifixes? You know? If you know, please, please comment down below with all the tips you might have. Where to look for fingers and these crucifixes. There's like no activity in this house today. No cruise fixes, no fingers, no nothing. Okay. And there's no activity from the spirits. a little boring actually <laughs> so this should be a good place to find fingers you know if he has been using the saw or something not being very good at it
No crucifix. No fingers. No activity. Come on now. Why is there no ghostly activity? At least. You might have to go home and come back because I think this might be a a bug or something this can't be right right let's do that what the F do we use that Ouija port for tell me in the comments if you know please let's go home and come back Do one more time. Last time in this episode. So we had a wraith. And if I remember correctly, last time we had a wraith, they are pretty aggressive. But we had no activity at all. Let's get the standard stuff. And hey. This first time we are remembering to look at the secondary objectives. Collect the salt bags. Find the sitting human silhouette using the ectoplasma glass. Okay. Have the ghost blow out the candle. We don't have a candle. We can find salt bags. And use that ectoplasma gear. Ectoplasma glass. To see a silhouette. Of a sitting spirit. I'm back. Honey, I'm home. Maybe we can have it blow out this candle. <laughs> and I didn't even see any crucifixes around. Do you want to play? Hello? <laughs> Holy <laughs> crap! Yeah, <laughs> you scared me good, you bitch. I hate you. Is there no activity because we are turning on all these lights? Oh, be on the lookout for salt bags. Have to. To look around. <coughs> Excuse me. Hello. Not much going on now. <laughs> Get me every time. Scaring the shit out of me, man. No salt bags in here. Do they even look like? I don't know. Are they white? Are they black? Are they grey? I have no clue. I heard some light switching. Somewhere. Oh! We had a 5. EMF level 5. Let's leave this here. The easel as well. The 
don't know if it's in here, but we're out in this corridor. But finally, we do have some activity. What did you say? You creepy bitch. I think we'll take the ectoplasma glass this time. So maybe we will see the silhouette. And also we'll take this one. Because like the easel, that is also, you know, a passive. We can just put it down on the floor. So, let's have this out all the time. Hopefully we can see this silhouette. That should bring us some money, I think. Did I turn on the lights here? I actually think I did. Let's turn on some lights up here. Let's see if we can find an ecto plasma stain no nope let's have a look around all the house because this should be a an okay easy objective to clear maybe Oh, I hate this room. <laughs> I effing hate this room. Okay, no silhouette. Let's try in here. silhouette in here so it must be in the basement then or I think it's actually randomly generated all the time you know you can see it at any time anywhere I believe We have been all all around the house now without seeing it. Also, I've not seen any salt bags yet. Now I'm getting salty. Okay. Oh, I just thought that was someone. So the activity just stopped up here, yeah? There's definitely no ectoplasma stuff here. Hello? Draw on that easel, please. Oh, let's put this one down as well. I forgot to do that. Put it here. And let's... 
go down and get our uh, spirit box. Oh, that's not the correct way. I'm not seeing that silhouette anywhere either. Let's get the hell out of here. Now we know where the ghost or spirit is located. Let's get this one. Let's get back inside. This creepy old abandoned house. We will keep looking through this ectoplasma thingy. Hopefully we will see the silhouette somewhere. Are you drawn on my easel? No. Nope. Are you here? Are you friendly? Whoa. What is your name? Are you an evil spirit? What is your name? Are you friendly? Are you here? Am I alone? Where are you? Are you friendly? Are you friendly? Where are you? This doesn't give anything either. Hmm. Let's go out and get the UV lights as well. Hello. I think the best thing to do when we have crucifixes <coughs> is to guess what goes to this and then go after the secondary objectives. Okay. Let's get back in here. Check for fingerprints. Any fingerprints here? getting haunted and we are dead oh that was the wrong way as always this is hard man Jesus Christ so please if you have any tips leave them in the comments below if you would like me to continue playing this game leave a like and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss an episode Thank you all for watching, until next time, bye bye.